one about chain slings. And as an end user, are you able to buy the individual components and assemble your own chain sling? What are the requirements or the uh, standards related to that? I'll take this one. Um, so on a chain sling, you could technically buy your own components and assemble your chain sling. Where you are taking on the liability and risk is now you must have that tag and that serial number and that documentation and keep all that, that you are that manufacturer. So in the manufacturer, instead of it saying Mozilla, it could say client number two, and then you ultimately are responsible for those slings. Um, would not see it with a welded chain because um, customers would not be set up at a weld with weld stations, uh, but a mechanical sling Technically, if you have those ASME B30.9 standards, you could make your own chain sling. We have seen companies do that. A lot of companies used to make their own chain slings. I will tell you with the world of accountant and attorneys, um, I can tell you that probably only a single percent. So I would say 5% or less of companies still do that. Because what we do at Mozilla, we're gonna assemble these components. We're gonna inspect it and then we're gonna pull test it. So to two times it's working the limit. So now you have documentation to show we checked our craftsmanship before it even left our door. Great question. Absolutely, I'd like to just tag on to that a second. Uh, as, as Adam said, one of the requirements of a chain sling is that it be proof tested. So if you assemble it yourself, you're relying on the manufacturer's proof test of each individual component. And as Adam said, not only do we rely on that when we build it at Mozilla, but as a final check before it goes out the door, we test the assembly as a unit and provide you with documentation to show that that has been tested. I will also say, Adam, I've seen a lot of customers over the years that uh, have done that and I would, you know, built their own slings. And I would say that the highest percentage of, of uh, uh, incorrectly manufactured or poorly manufactured slings fell to the to people who tried to do it on their own. Rely on the experts. We're there to help you.